What's going on guys? Welcome to day two of the Grid Life Festival. Uh, this is where everything gets absolutely crazy. Uh, so we're gonna start the day off by going to get some groceries. <clears throat> um, if you haven't seen the videos before this, you should watch those, but uh, yeah, we'll be back in a minute. Hey guys, so um, it's around lunchtime right now. We didn't do a lot this morning. You saw we just ran into town. Hopefully you can hear this, but uh, we're just gonna do a walk around the paddock. Kate's gonna introduce me to some people. It's gonna go see some cool cars. So hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing some of the cool shit we got in the paddock. We are now gonna load up the truck. We're gonna go check out some of the other sections of the track that not a lot of people cover. Uh, the famous S's. Um, everybody kind of goes to the keyhole for drifting. So we're gonna see the S's, which is the other part that they drift in. Uh, and it's pretty neat because they come on in a really fast clip. So we're gonna head up there, get some cool shots. So just finished up one of the drift sessions for the day. Kind of a neat spot to shoot. It's not the best because obviously you've got the fence in the way and it's a, just a little too high. If I was like seven foot, it'd be perfect. But yeah, kind of a neat spot to get to see some cool angles. So we'll uh, see how everybody else did. Get in the truck. Get in, bitches. We're going to the mall. Pretty good drift session. Best one of the day. First one we saw today. Yeah, so best one of the day. <laughs> All right. So just walking through the pits, got to see a couple of people. Uh, went and. Uh, Check out the drift meeting. It's always kind of neat to uh, pop your head in to see what's actually going on, see what they want to change. But you know, everybody seemed to be pretty happy about it. Nick Swan, the guy who runs it, uh, just telling guys to go hard and uh, go fast and, and put on a show. And you know what? If you're uh, if you saw the drift footage from yesterday, some of the drift footage from today, you know these guys are going hard already. So I'm not sure how they can be able to go faster or crazier, but. Uh, Hopefully we can uh, get some kind of ride along. I can get some ride along footage for you guys on this. If if for some reason I can't, make sure to check out our driver profile videos because those always have ride along footage on them. All right. So after bugging Nate about having to walk his ass all the way up to this crazy spot, uh, he then sends us a radio. But an hour later, and asked if we could bring up batteries. So being the good friend that I am, and him being our track dad. That is Nate's nickname, by the way. We call him Track Dad because he's our father figure whenever we're at the track. I'm now going to hike all the way up to that big sign up there. I don't know if you can see it. Hike up there to drop batteries off and, well, fuck it. Might as well hang out and film some shit because it's a really cool spot. So maybe I'll time lapse the walk. So once again, the parts of getting a great shot, Nate being the master of the great shot, this is the shit that we go through. So, but you get some outstanding views. All right, so we're uh, just about to start filming a 3.30 drift session. So.
Wicked session, super happy about that. Um, it was neat to get this kind of angle. Uh, I think I'm gonna head back to see the guys. Gonna get some dinner going. Nate's sticking it out for a bit longer because he's a champ. And he's got, uh, he's got a wife to feed, so he's gonna take some more photos. Down there would be kind of neat too. I was looking, I was walking back. I found all this shrapnel from bikes, cars, rims, giant ant hill. I should probably walk away now. Just show so much carnage this track has seen. <laughs> That's staying in. Uh, so Clayton and I were kind of out late, uh, just after nine o'clock now. Um, kind of wicked day, just seeing some drifting, hanging out with friends, people rudely interrupting on four wheelers and motorbikes. Uh, um, we uh, just finished recording a podcast. Fuck that guy. We just finished recording a podcast with Ian from Dylan Sharp Racing. So now we are going to go up uh, with some wobbly pops, go see Ludacris, come back down, catch the McGregor fight, and uh, see what else this night has in store. But this is the Saturday night for Grid Life. This is when all the fun shit happens. And uh, enjoy the ride. Hands up! Hands up! up at Ludacris. I am not a rap fan, but that was pretty cool. I, I won't lie. I, 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 I've seen not, the movies. No, oh, I've seen it in the movies. Oh, okay. I know some of the songs, not my scene, but yeah, it was pretty fucking awesome. You too bad I can't. For this. That been cool. Too bad I can't use any of the music because it's licensed. So I'm gonna put something super funny. Well, I guess you would have already watched it technically. So sorry about the super funny music that went over top of Ludacris. But uh, we're gonna go watch the McGregor fights now. Hey guys, so we just uh, finished up watching the McGregor fight. Uh, immediately got into an argument right afterwards, so that's about that's about right. What's up? What's up? What's buddy? up? Fuck yeah! So I'm assuming the pit party's gonna start now. Yeah, uh, revving engines. So we might walk around a little bit, try and find some parties. But uh, welcome to Saturday Night at Grid Life. <laughs> 